haven't been in marriage for a period of about five years. It has been, you know, it has been an emotional battle. But on that day when she was in labor, we were all waiting, prayerfully waiting. And the matron came out and said, Mr. Nyebu, congratulations. We brought out four babies. It was a miracle. My husband was praying that if God would give him three clerks, I was saying, no, it has to be twin, a boy and a girl, and I'll close there. And the Lord shut us up with quadruplets. And so wonderful seeing my babies. When I was being delivered of the quadruplets, they said, no, our mother will still have more. I was thinking, uh, the scans were all saying two, three, how four. Okay, the babies are healthy. They are all healthy at the moment. They are out of, they are not in incubator. They are good sizes. From my husband, he's, a, he's good. There was no pressure from him. I was the one giving him the pressure. But all medical checks, all medical examinations that I was asked to do, my husband was providing the fund and I was making sure I go through the checks. I am 43, what is 41? I haven't been in marriage for a period of about five years. It has been, you know, it has been an emotional battle. When my wife took him, you know, initially we went for scan and it said that the scan said it is not one. And in the later years of the later stages of the pregnancy, even up to two days to delivery, the scan said it was three. But on that day when she was in labor, we were all waiting, prayerfully waiting. And the matron came out and said, Mr. Nyebu, congratulations. We brought out four babies. It was a miracle. First time we are delivering quadruplets in this uh, hospital. This is the first time in the history of the establishment of Father Medical Center, Buto Meta, that we're having uh, quadruplets in the station, quadruplet delivery by a single mother. By and large, the, the patient management has, has been going on unwell and babies are doing well and we thank God for giving us the opportunity of having the space of the scanning and also that cutting us, uh, cutting us worthy the part of the good good uh, good, uh, good success stories of this couple. The third gender operated her, they operated on her was Dr. Adebayo. So after the first baby was taken out, the second, the third baby, they noticed after they were trying to, okay, this and that, we are done now. We noticed that, okay, it seems there's something, another baby inside, and they went in and they brought out the fourth baby. And everybody was happy. Oh, on the check check, call the place. Everybody was happy. Then they told the woman too that it seems there's another baby in there. She was happy. You can see the joy written all over her. Fatlessness is not always about infertility. It's not always about impotence. It may be that certain things in the body are not functioning well. So while praying, also seek medical counsel. I thank God Almighty. It's just a little while I'll go home with my children and my husband. And also must commend my husband. He's been so wonderful. He's been a father. He's been everything. May the Lord bless him. We prayed for just one child or two, and God gave us four. I don't think I'm going to request for another. Well, I'll close that prayer chapter. <laughs>